Hey there, it's good to see you. Flirt with Gina. As a scholar, I have to be hard on myself. Not very many Polyans, whether we, they are Majuri or Gumulkin, have the opportunity or responsibility of exploring these ruins. If I don't add to our understanding with my research, I'm effectively taking away knowledge the world could have gotten from a more capable scholar. And yours was the first face I saw. I never thought it about it that way before. I hope I made a fr good first impression. <laughs> You're the best part of my day. Interesting. I need to speak to Hecla because I have no idea what Gina wants. I always look forward to your visit. Oh, 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 so there you are. I was just thinking about you. Can I say that? Only if I can say it too. Well, I mean, I wouldn't presume to tell you what you can and can't say. <laughs> tell me more about yourself. Can you believe I'm the only scholar doing her thesis on the human re-emergence? I have to admit that I look forward to work more now that I have a research partner like you around. Just a research partner? Oh, well, I mean, did you want to be more? I didn't want to assume. I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> What is it? Oh, you're back. That's good. I was getting a little worried. Of course I am. It's just sometimes I worry that when you leave, you'll re realize that you actually hate me. So when you come back, I can relax because that means you don't hate me yet. Okay. Okay. Interesting, Gina. Of course I'm going to come back. Hello, Gina. Oh, hey, how's it going? Oh my, it's my favorite research partner. Does that make me an archaeologist too? You've helped me countless of times. Of course you are. Great, because I'm digging you. Well, I'm digging you too. Digging, that means you like me, right? Because that's what digging means? I hope that's what digging means. <laughs> She's... <laughs> Hi, Gina. Fascinating. Oh, sorry. Just making some quick observations. Can I help you? Um, yes. If you were an angle, you'd be a cute. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> gonna miss you. Oh. Hi, Gina. Come out here to see hey there, it's good to see you. Oh, it's my favorite research partner. Does that make me an archaeologist too? You've helped me countless times. Of course you are. I'm glad I could help. Trust me, yo. Zo. Trust me, Zo. You're way more than just help. Oh. Okay. Ah, she has an exclamation point mark. Hey you, you must be a star because I can't stop orbiting around you. Oh, that was so embarrassing. Forget I said that. I was trying something. It didn't work. Don't worry, it was cute. It's just, I've noticed that you've been a bit flirty with me and I was trying to be flirty back. But I guess there are other ways of flirting that don't rely on astronomy based to pick up lines. Why don't we go on a date? A date? That might be fun. I've always thought picnics were super romantic. Maybe you could bring something while I'm working? Sure. Let's have a picnic. Hi, Gina. I have your picnic basket. I was so lost in my research, I almost didn't see you there. It's picnic time. I know you were looking forward to eating together today, but Hecla made me something earlier and she insisted I eat it. I told her you were coming, but she ensured me that her meal had the correct balance of proteins and lipids. So I, uh... Ate it. Don't take it personally. I just didn't want to make her mad. We could totally do something else right now, though. Like, um, maybe you could help me out with my research? That sounds fun, right? Oh, I almost forgot. I brought these flowers as a centerpiece for a picnic. We may not be having the picnic anymore, but I thought you should at least keep the flowers. Or, as a scholar, I have to be hard on myself. Not very many Polyans, whether they are Marjorie or Grimal, can have the opportunity or responsibility of exploring these ruins. If I don't add to our understanding with my research, I'm effectively taking- Oh, oh. And that's when I fell for you, literally. That's what you meant, right? <laughs> Hi. Glad you stopped by. I was wondering how you were doing. Oh, so there you are. I was just thinking about you. Can I say that? You can say whatever you want. <laughs> if I did that, I might actually shrivel up and die from embarrassment. Um, but you will both do it together. Um, Nail? Gina? 
Dear Zoe, Hecla finished translating one of the books in the old human library. It is a book of love poetry. I was hoping you might want to meet me to discuss. There's a passage in it I wanted to read to you. Okay, Gina. Right there. Hi, Gina. Oh, uh, hey, how's it going? You had something you wanted me to read? Yes, I found this in an old human book of love poetry, and I thought, as a human, you might have an opinion on it. Our friendship was like a caterpillar. It was meant to be for a moment in time. But now that moment has passed, and I find us in a chrysalis. We cannot go back to what we were any more than a caterpillar can leave its cocoon and still be a caterpillar. I do not know what is to come, but I find myself hoping for the butterfly. So what do you think? It reminds me of us. Really? I feel exactly the same way. I really, really like you. And it's hard to keep seeing you as just a friend. Here's my pin. I made it from some human things I found in the ruins and reminded me of you. I hope you'll consider wearing it to show that we, what we mean to each other. Anyway, um, I gotta run. Hecla needs me to help her with something, but let's talk later, okay? Okay. Thanks for the blueberry pie. Hi guys. Oh. Thank you for following along. I hope you join me on the rest of this romance saga. And I'm going to go now. Till next time. If you enjoyed this or anything I make, please leave me a like. Subscribe. Maybe a comment. I appreciate y'all. Oh, and this is just a sneak peek of my house. <laughs>